Green Tree 1936. Once again, the greatest steeplechase in the world has brought its thousands of fans from the corners of the earth. It has brought perfect weather too for the most hazardous of all sporting events. Watching the parade, the sensations of the Lincolnshire are still fresh in the mind. What more thrills will the National give us? Golden Miller leads the parade, then Reynolds Town. Avenger, the favourite, at 100 to 30, then double crossed. <laughs> Now 35 thoroughbreds are lined up at the starting gate and they're up on a four and a half mile gallop over 30 testing jumps. Now watch the first jump and see how Golden Miller fell. to Beecher's Brook, for once this dreaded leap claims no victim. Double Crust and Davy Jones are leading here from Kiltoy, Reynolds Town, Inversible, Emancipator, all going well. The canal turn brings down Delanasian Blaze. Valentine's Brook, David Jones leading now from double trust and again the field thins out. On they go and Evasio Mun and Hillsbrook go out of the race. see the Miller fall again on the right-hand side. The Miller had been remounted and ridden on, only to come down where he fell last year. into the straight for the first time, Davy Jones is leading. Now the water jump, nearly the end of the first time round and all gets safely over. Into the country for the second time, Davy Jones double crossed Avenger the favourite with Jockey and Czech Silks are all well played. And now for the jump that fell the Miller. This fatal fence and rail brings little Avenger crashing down to kick out the tragic finish of his last race. Avenger's neck is broken. to Beaches for the second time. David Jones and Double Cross are in the lead with Reynolds Town going strong. Beaches has no terrors today. Now it's a fight between David Jones and Reynolds Town with Double Cross near at hand. Reynolds Town's jockey has lost his whip.
now turn. Davy Jones keeping well ahead now. Now get ready for an amazing finish. Davy Jones is still leading from Reynolds Town. Davy Jones going easily and well. He looks a certain winner. One. Excitement is terrific, but Davy Jones has broken the rain. What now? The last jump. The crowd roars as Davy Jones runs out of the course and out of the race. He must have won, but it's Reynolds Town now. Wallin brings him safely home 12 lengths in front of Ego, with Bachelor Prince third. Great race, the first horse to win the Grand National two years in succession since 1870.